Hey guys, a couple of months ago I did this video which was about the HP laptop but uh, some of the inquiries that I ended up receiving wasn't about the actual laptop itself but it was about the actual wallpaper that I had on my desktop. As you can see, I've got an aquarium, a live aquarium going in the background and it's not actually a screensaver. You can see the icons and the taskbar there so it's an actual moving wallpaper. And most of you wanted to find out how I achieved that, especially on the Windows 10 PC. So today is going to be about how you can make any video of your choice as a desktop background for your computer. Let's get started. In most situations, I would say fire up your favorite browser and visit a particular website. In this situation, it would normally be desktophut.com, which is the application that we need to use in order to create our animated wallpapers. When I went to download the software, however, I clicked on the link and then I went ahead to download the software as I usually do but then I was intercepted by my antivirus program and it said not to download the program because now this website is being linked to malicious websites. So what I did was I extracted the program myself and I uploaded to my Google Drive for you guys to have a clean version of. So this is the link that I'll be putting in the description below this video where you can go ahead and click on and go directly to my Google Drive to download the actual program. It's a standalone program so it doesn't have to be installed and it runs directly from a folder without any installation. How great is that? So when you go to my Google Drive, you just click on the little down arrow on the top right hand corner of the web page, regardless of what browser you're using, and download the zipped program. Go ahead and click on save. And once it's done, you'll find it in your downloads folder. Go ahead and right click on the zip folder you just downloaded and select extract all. And then click extract. Once the folder has been extracted, go ahead and double click on it to open it up and you will find six icons inside. The main application is the third one down, which is the desktop hut app. Double click on it to open it and you will see the main program window. This is where we'll be selecting our live wallpaper which is any video of our choice and then we can play it as a desktop wallpaper. Before we do this though we need to find some videos to download. For this I have a great website I usually go to which is videos.pexels.com Pexels is a great website for providing free stock footage for everybody and you can find a whole bunch of pictures and videos that you can download for free. Go ahead and get familiar with this website and search around for some video footage and possibly download what you fancy. I prefer time-lapse videos as they don't feel too intrusive once they're on the desktop and they look pretty cool. I'm going to go and download this video and select save. This is what the video would look like if you played in a normal standalone player. However, we need to let the program know that this is our favourite footage. Go back to the main program and select live wallpaper and then point it into the direction to where you've downloaded the recent video. In my situation that would be downloads, select, click open and then press play. And now you will see 
that the time lapse video is my desktop background. As you can see, I can now have any window open in the foreground and it will not affect the background play, just as if my wallpaper is alive. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Give me a thumbs up if you liked it. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Cheers.